hi guys welcome back to my channel uh, i don't want to sound like some mamas who i really love like yo our, they're the ones who started youtube for us eh? they started booming in kenya shout out to you over 25 oh well so eh, I, I don't know i don't know what i wanted to do today i would like to this is just so random but well as i was looking for my things in fact i was looking for what a spring i was looking for a spring trying to fix my tripod and in my things and then i came across my journals oh my goodness okay so it's not like a diary it's just like a book a book i chose to be writing stuff when i was pregnant and also this is yeah so I should be journaling that's what i've noticed like at least it helped me during that time and i have i was just reading my goodness i was just reading about i read one of the one of the letters and my goodness i have just realized i was very depressed i was very depressed during my pregnancy Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna put any blame on anyone, but I was very depressed. And basically it's because I I feel like I wasn't getting the support that I needed. It was it was just a very very hectic pregnancy, especially when you're not uh, uh, around your support system the only support system that i was getting at the time was when i was talking to talking to my my mom and my friends most of the time on phone that was the support system <laughs> it was very interesting anyway moving on swiftly i thank god for where i am right now um yeah I thank God for him. I am right now, and my baby came out very well. She came out healthy. She came to this world fine. <sighs> yeah, but I was very depressed because I have just read my a few of the pages in my journal, and wow, I was depressed because of the. <laughs> environment that i was in it wasn't friendly it wasn't friendly it wasn't emotionally friendly it wasn't mentally friendly it was just manipulative and you know all sorts of things but oh well here we are we are fine and we are still moving and we thank god hmm. my baby is 19 months old yeah we turn every first day of the month so that keeps me on top of my game in terms of the dates. Have you ever gone to clinic and you're asked, how old is your baby? And you're like, hmm. you can't even remember. <laughs> or you confuse the months and the and the years and yeah, it, it gets tricky. I prefer months. But when she turns two, I think I'll stop now saying that she's this month old. Now I'm still joyriding on. She's 12 months old. Or she's 19 months old yeah she's 19 months that's one year seven months anywho I feel like I should read this letter I feel like I should read it yeah so it's 15th May 2020 oh it's just one of the journals I hope you are well in mommy's womb oh no this that's not how I started let me rewind selector 15th May 2020. Hi, daughter. I hope you're well in mommy's womb. I enjoy feeling your kicks every time you're awake or you want to eat. Uh, you just wake me up and maybe you're looking for a position to sleep well and that means I can't sleep definitely. Well, when a baby turns in your tummy, my friend, <laughs> you will be awake until atulie. However, I treasure every moment that I feel your presence and I get worried when I don't. Yeah, I used to get worried if she hasn't kicked. Like, eh, when I feel too weird. Because that's one of the signs you should be monitoring. 
when the baby starts kicking that's from month five kondelea yep mm -hmm. two weeks ago i found out that you are a baby girl through an ultrasound scan i just hope that it didn't lie to me let's pause there the reason why i say that is because <laughs> I've heard of cases you go for an ultrasound and <coughs> you decided to buy all the pink clothes in the world and yet you find out that it's a boy and we also bought dresses mind you what are you going to do so guys I'll just advise you please if you can't buy unisex clothes trust me when a baby is that tiny you cannot tell whether the baby is a girl or a boy it doesn't really matter so but to be safe, just carry unisex clothes. That's safe, yeah? So, yeah, even for those who cannot afford going for an ultrasound, be there next time. Next time, if I, if, I, if I get there, if I get in that position of carrying a baby next time, not so next time, hmm, I'll just do unisex clothes. Hey, my baby was tall, but there she came, and the clothes that we had bought... <laughs> fitting her but at least we mixed them up like a big size small size my baby was tall mm. anyway that was that i hope you get to grow and be a stronger lady than mommy mm. hey 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 I, I don't feel like reading any more of this like let, let me just stop there because Okay. Since you're my daughter, please let no one put you down. I will do my best to always encourage you to be yourself and confident in every situation that you're in. Love, mom. I think... I think I'll stop there. It's it's very it's very sensitive for me right now. But basically yeah, on fifteenth of May that's when I journaled about knowing the sex of my baby and yeah, we are here. And life is good. Yeah. We are going through the healing process, we are going through so much adjustments, but I thank God for everything. Anyway, this video, this video was, is brought to you by the products I use on my baby's hair. Yep, as you all know, she's a girl from the channel, clearly. So, I want to show you what I use. And, yep. We're starting with the shampoo. <sighs> yeah, you all know this. You've seen it in the salon, supermarkets, wherever. I use baby dab for my baby's hair and so far so good it's cruelty free as they've said it's tear free however I'm not sure about it being tear free because my baby oh my baby doesn't like um when it gets into her ears I mean eyes I mean no one likes when shampoo gets into their eyes yeah so about that i'm not so sure but it's a really good shampoo i like it even the scent is really good yo this is not sponsored eh? just saying dove they're doing a good job so far next is a living conditioner it's called Ma hey, mayan we Ma hey. that's the name that's the name you guys can see perfecto it's an it's a leave-in conditioner that's very good for detangling hair Tang even my my own hair it is really good i've used it i had twists on and when i removed them hey i did not comb that hair for a week hey but when i applied this and then i started combing at least i felt better but the pain the pain of blow drying my hair oh lord anyway it's a really good detangler 
and as you've seen it's enriched with aloe vera gel castor oil and goat milk it's actually natural and it is good for natural and color treated hair this one i got it at best lady but it's really good it's really good and it also has a really nice scent uh-huh let me tell you the ingredients sea tile flaxseed castor oil sunflower oil beeswax aloe vera gel goat milk aqua vitamin e and p20 so apply a generous amount on your palms and distribute it evenly on your hair after a shampoo wash so definitely use it after a shampoo then repeat the process if needed so comb gently and style as usual yo you can just apply it and walk yes after combing your hair or styling it the way you want to style i had an afro for a week as i was telling you and this was the jam but they have also used it to detangle wigs but they try it try it and tell me how it will go i can show you a picture of how that wig lo looks on my hair and i used to fluff it up and it looked really good by the way yep that was this that was it and then hey this one this one is going to be controversial anywho so i borrowed a friend of mine the oil the hair oil and it has a lot wow wow i've forgotten all the details but i remember it has coconut coconut cream it has vanilla what else does it have oh it's made of coconut vanilla and what else it was specially made for my friend let me not even show all the details but it's yeah it's liquid right now i don't know if you can see ah yeah that's it you can see that but it smells really nice highlight it has vanilla like your hair just smells like you want to bite it it's really really good hey so for more tips on hair protection protective styling oh before i forget shout out to i was told is it alkebulan alkebulan roots they're the ones who are making this beautiful 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 oil plus they also make shea butter just visit their page i will link i will put their name right here mm, it's been a minute since i was on youtube so but i'll put it right here oh that's better right here <laughs> otherwise see you next time bye